Yo, what is going on guys? Miss Barshot Noob here and today I'm bringing you another Fallout 4 episode. So in this video I'm going to be doing the quest reunions following Dog Me and we'll see what's going on. I think this is part of the main quest so I'm actually looking forward to doing this. And I think Nick, I think he's part of this quest as well. I'm not quite sure. But yeah, so I hope you guys enjoy this episode of Fallout. And definitely subscribe for more. So, I don't know if this has been glitchy, but I've been... I think I tried it in a other episode, and I don't think I posted it. Dog meat just goes off in random places, stuff like that. But I've got quite far... So yeah, we're just going to finish this off and then we'll move on to the next main quest. I haven't got my headphones in, so I can't actually hear anything. But maybe if we come to a cutscene, I might quickly put them in. So I apologise for that. Also, I apologise for my voice. If it sounds a bit weird, a bit crooked, anything like that. I am ill at the moment. I've got sore throat. I might have a chest infection. Something like that. Keep coughing, all that stuff. But yeah. I'm going to try not to cough as much in this video because I know it can be annoying but obviously I can't help anything about my voice, it's just the way it is so I'm sorry for that and I hope you guys can get past my awful voice but yeah, let's just jump straight into this so, I haven't actually completed this, I know a lot of people have but no one's actually told me anything about it and I just want to complete it for myself I know I should have had it completed a long time ago and I just can't say sorry enough for stopping this series. I know I shouldn't have because it's just, I don't know, to be honest. Like, everything's patched now and I can't really do as much stuff as I want and all that. But, oh well, can't really do it. Search for clues. Right, so i got to search for clues now. So, oh god, that is not a good clue, is it? Inspect. A decoy, huh? Well, that was actually really easy, that. Uh, inspect it again. Well, that the clue? Yeah, we've got to follow dog meat again now. I wonder how long you've got to follow this dog for. Jesus Christ. We just love the surroundings of Fallout. Also, I'm thinking about bringing an episode, uh, maybe top five must places to visit. I found some pretty cool places, searched them up, not a lot of people have them. And it's just a cool place, what I think. That's Ultron. Please don't activate that. Oh, I think it's talking. Hang on. So it looks like we've got... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on a minute. Hang on here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Two death claws. Got no ammo for barely any of our guns. Might have a bit for this. So. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, I think I'm just going to let these guys battle it out. Nah. Throw some grenades in there. Get launching some of them. Oh no 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 no. These cars have such a huge explosion. Just keep throwing grenades. Dog meat, get out of the way. Right, so that's one. I oh, would just finish that off. So that's two. Let's stim pack this guy up. You gotta stick together, pal. Oh, may maybe not. But yeah, as I was saying guys, I think I'm going to be starting a series of top five places to visit. Just some new ones, look pretty cool. Uh, yeah, so definitely let me know in the comments if I should start that. Another thing is I was thinking of starting another series on Fallout called Best Gun with a question mark 
this is going to be a series where I try to find a load of good guns, all that sort of stuff, using guides, YouTube videos, all that stuff. I'll put it and then I'll just make a load of videos on them and you can decide which is the best gun, uh, which guns you like to use, comment some guns, what you found, all that good stuff. Uh, I found a good gun which I think it could be one of the best guns in the game. Basically, well, you see what I mean about it getting all glitched, please carry on. But basically, I found this gun, and it has an unlimited magazine, all that good stuff, but I can't find it again. But, yeah, I am looking at some techniques on how to acquire a load of rare stuff. I think I found one technique on how to get a load of rare stuff. I'm just going to have to search it up and see if anyone's done a video. Because there's no point me doing one if someone else has already done one. But if nobody's done one, then I'll definitely post it. But if somebody has done a video on my technique, well, it isn't mine, but on the technique that I have found, then I probably won't be doing that video. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy, and we'll see where things go. It looks like we're following this dog for some time, huh? I don't know. Don't know what it's possibly seen. Oh, right. one on the other side. Fort Hagen. What the hell are we doing at Fort Hagen? That's what I want to know. Check on dog meat. What's this place? Huh? See in here, boy. Right, so we've got to find a way into here. So I'm going to check the roof. Probably is a way on the roof. Told you. Let's go destroy these. Oh dear. Right, running out of ammo as well, which is definitely not a good thing. Let's get in Fort Hagen. And let's see what's going on in here. Oh, not these guys. Oh dear, that's not a good sign. Hang on a minute, let me just plug my charger in. The last thing I want is my controller going dead. And I'll, uh, I'm running out of bullets really quick. Oh lord. I always think that these synths are so creepy. Mind you, speaking of a sim. I've also upgraded this gun as well, and wow, it is so overpowered. It just kills everything instantly. If you want me to do a guide on how I got this gun to where it is now, definitely just leave it in the comments, and I will definitely do a guide on my gun, how I found it, and what upgrades I am using, all that good stuff. And it's not hacked, by the way. It's a hundred percent legit, and I just think that it's awesome. It takes absolutely everything out. Right, let's switch to another gun, cause we've run out of ammo for that. I've got this crap gun. Guessing that terminals to get in there, but they don't really seem like all good in there. To be honest. 
Alright, so I'm guessing we've got to go up here now. Go all the way. Nope. Nope. And uh, nope. Another good thing about having a jetpack on power armor is if you see any holes in the roof, you can just quickly jetpack up them. Because some buildings have holes where if you're on the top floor, they're meant to trick you and bring you all the way down, stuff like that. But obviously, if you have the jetpack, you can use them to go up and makes things quite easy as well. Um, pretty much like that. But that was... I've been on that floor, so we need to go back down. Right. I actually don't know which way to go. So I'm guessing it's going to be this way. What are we finding here? What are we getting at? Something here? No. Right, well, it seems to be in here. Unless it's up somewhere. Don't know why I took that. Right, I'm gonna take a guess. Maybe it's upwards in an elevator. <laughs> Let's have a look. It says we're going down, but. I don't know. Anyway. Well, this is a new area, so what's this? Let's not go there. Oh god. Throw a grenade there. Oh lord. Oh, this does not look good. See, I always think that these ones seem like the creepiest. I don't know, maybe it's from, like, when I was little, I used to watch Terminator, and uh, it always used to just creep the hell out of me, like, the way that they looked and everything, and I think the synths kind of look like that. Maybe that's why I always find them so creepy. I don't think he needs a roommate. Yeah, if you are enjoying any bit of this episode so far, definitely be sure to leave a like. It always helps me out, lets me know that you guys are enjoying this as much as I am. All that good stuff shows me support, all that. I do think that we need a better gun though. I'll get some ammo later. I think that totally missed. Really? I barely did anything to them. I'm gonna quickly check as well is if I can attack if I can put that in that put that there aim attack right so that's grenade and L2 for Vax because I don't know if you guys can hear this but whenever I go like that and just like shooting like this is much more efficient for me also these are my call of duty controls as well so easier to get used to anything good in here that's worth taking not really no right let's just go 
give this guy a nice little visit or not because the door's locked. Um, right. I'm going to take a guess that maybe this terminal might do something. Not quite sure though. Absolutely hate hacking terminals. They're so annoying. I, I don't have a clue how to hack them. Do you know what? I'm going to go for a sign. Alright, well that were wrong. Uh, this is probably my most hated thing. Turret remote now control. Don't know what this is doing. What? Well, that didn't do anything. I don't think that there was any point in that. Something in here. Anything? Well, it was two stim packs. A lot of pre war money. I'll take that, not gonna lie. Right, so hopefully, this door's open now, but it's really not. Right. I just need to figure out how to get this door open. What's that now? Maybe something, yeah. Somewhere there. Right, so we need to get down here. These doors open? Nope. Right, I will find this out. So we've got all these doors here. Is that a door there? No. Right, so there must be something in here that gives away. Right, what's this thing? Right, so there must be something down here. What's here? It's just a toilet. This guy has got some heavy fortification, hasn't he? I think my armour is about to break. Because I keep getting hit from everywhere. I actually hate that the melee is where you throw a grenade as well. You have to hold it in for a grenade. I'd rather just not have melee. Take this fusion car. Take this fusion cell. Is that destroyed? Right. In here. Pretty much nothing. Do you know what I've always wondered? Like, hold on, this guy speaking. There's one idea now. I don't know if it would be a good idea, but it's always been on my mind since I've had like power armor and stuff, right? And basically, if any of you guys play Bioshock. I am a big fan of Bioshock, as you can tell by my name, but I've been wondering, okay, so you're in a big suit like this, and it's kind of like Bioshock, isn't it? because you're in a big suit, and you have your little headlight, and all this, and I just think that it'd be so cool if they did Bioshock like this, where you could have jetpacks on, and all this, and I just think that it'd be just so cool to have all that stuff. And that when you use your jetpack and then go down, when you land on the ground and it does that annotation, I just think that would be cool to add to Bioshock. But that's just my opinion. Right, where am I? Uh, I'm just going to take all this. Got some good loot here. Open this. Give me a novice look. Pretty easy. What's in here? Millimeter, fat man. Ooh. Hello. Take that. I actually need some weapons, just any weapons that I have ammo for. Do they have any machine guns? No? No machine guns? No? 
Only if I take this, will I be able to... Oh. Right, so let's keep going down here. I don't always have zero chance. Let's use that. That did absolutely nothing. Yeah, there, there was... Okay, we've died. Probably because I never actually look at my health, but whoops, keep running, just keep running, just keep running, running, running. Right, so now we've got to kill him, for God's sake. Let's try and get something that's actually going to help us out. Right, maybe this. Not quite sure. Oh, I want this. Yeah, let's talk. Come on, open this door. Let's get this over and done with. Are you, are you going to open this door? Or do I have to open this door? Who's got to open this door? Ammo box. Hold on. I really want to get into this ammo box. Really? There's like nothing there. You know what? Let's just throw a grenade at this guy. Could have sworn he said his sims were standing down. Apparently not. Alright, let's go give this guy a little visit. Be alright if you open doors, wouldn't it? Nice one. Yeah, your sims are really not gonna back down either. You alright? Good see them. What gun is that? That seems like a disgraceful gun. That honestly does seem like an awful, terrible gun. See how these guys have got like laser weapons and he's a uh, pistol. The only thing what I like about energy weapons is they always have just so many like bullets and rounds. It's just crazy. Like, where is this guy? This guy's doing good. That was easy. He's caps. Right, what's he got here? Gellog's pistol. Refills your action points on a critical hit. I'm taking that. And I'm taking his terminal password. Taking that. I really want a fragment grenade. Uh, a recon hammer. I don't know what that is, but I'm just going to take it. I take a lot of stuff. Um, uh, these are actually worth quite a lot, believe it or not. So I'm going to take all these. Right, let's go on his computer then. Ooh, what else has he got? It's a recorder. I don't know what that is. Take these fuses. I'll take this. I'll take these. I just take it everything, to be honest. That's what I do. I just come in, just loot everything. Broken light bulb. I don't even know why I need a broken light bulb, but I'm taking it. Wow, this computer looks cool. What the hell have I done? Discuss your findings with Nick. Let's open these doors. Nick can wait for a minute. We've got some doors getting opened here. Don't you shush. Yeah, this it. Well, no one will find that. Anyway, let's talk to this guy. Right, so our son is in the institute, apparently. I'm in the weeds here. Time to take a step back, bring in some fresh eyes. Only person I know willing to snoop up the institute's tail feathers is Piper, a porter in Diamond City. I say we head her way, talk this through. Diamond City it is. Hey, chin up. I know the night just got dark. Right, 
Right, so let's go see Piper. I don't know what this guy's got to do with all. Why is there still a thing here? Hello? 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 Anyway, let's go and see, right? So I think there's a, uh, yeah, exit. There we go. If only it were that simple in the beginning. But. That'd be too easy, I guess. Wow, look at my power armor. My right arm's gone. Both of my legs have gone. That's not really good. Why do these elevators set so long? Didn't seem this long to get up there. Right, so finally we're here. Roof access. Let's get this door open. Open. Hey, we're out. Freedom. Excuse me, sir. What the hell? Oh, I didn't want to look at that. Well, what the hell? Wow. Now that looks pretty cool. Not gonna lie, look at that. Wow. That looks sick. I'm gonna kill you. No, I'm really not. Shadows of Steel started. Listen to. Guessing it's here. Is that it? Oh, yeah, that's cool. So maybe these are going to see Paladin Dance. I'm not quite sure to be honest, but wow, that's pretty sick. Right, so what have we got to do? Confront Kellogg, we've already done that. Don't mess about. We've already done that. Let's go to Diamond City. And then hopefully we should be done. Because this is like it's going forever. Wow. This has been one long mission. Well, it seems that way, but, you know, still. It's always hard when you're ill and you got to, like, make YouTube videos because you always got to talk, and I've tried so hard not to cough, stuff like that, and it's just, like, at the edge of coming out and stuff. I've got such a dry throat, and, oh, my God. I just want it to end. I'm just going to have a quick drink, I don't know. Well, I had a little drink. I feel a little bit better. Mr. Valentine walked into my office for a change. What can I say, Martha? You, me, hard luck all seem to run together like acid rain down an old sewer. You, uh, including your client here in that analogy? So, you two are finally letting me in on this little taste of yours. What's the story? been investigating these creeps for over a year now. <laughs> the Commonwealth Simulator. Feared and hated by everyone. True enough. Sometimes they snatch people in the middle of the night, and sometimes they leave old synths behind to remind us to 
about this, but to this day, there's one thing nobody really knows. Where the Institute actually is. Exactly. But there's one person who knows about it. The guy who just handed them shots. Hello. Great ending if he didn't still have the biggest mystery in the Commonwealth to solve. He wasn't going to talk. Even if I had a way of breaking him alive. Gets his brain huh. You know, we may not need the man at all. You're talking crazy here, Nick. Is that a fall from the old subway team? Look, there's a place in Good Neighbor called the Memory Den. Live the past moments in your mind as clear as the day they happen. If anyone could get a dead brain to sing, it would be Dr. Amari, the mind behind the memories. I hope you're right, Nick. Let's see. Enough gray matter to bring to Amari and find out if this is going to work. Jesus, Nick. No, seriously? I know it's grisly, but what choice do we have? We got no lead. Might have all the secrets we need to know. Actually, I think I already have something. Kellogg had this this thing attached to his head. Cybernetics, huh? We may have just won the lottery. Whether we're riding this crazy brain train or not, we can't all go running across the Commonwealth. So keep coming with me. I have to go to the memory den either way. there together, just say so. It's you and me. Let's get going. Don't worry. We're gonna get your boy back. Just a few more steps. Well, you two are out, so I'm gonna do some more research. I'll be here if you need me. Okay, well... So, we're getting quite a good gist of the story, and yeah, that brain thing seems absolutely crazy and mental, but we are in the future, so we can't expect anything. Anyway, nevertheless, if you have enjoyed this episode, definitely be sure to leave a like rating, I can't express this as much, it helps me out so much. Let's me know that you are enjoying this as much as I am, and all that great stuff. Another thing is subscribe. For more content, Fallout is finally back, Far Cry Primal, and of course, don't forget Minecraft Survival Island, Call of Duty, Black Ops 2, I mean free as well. Subscribe for all that amazing content, I love to keep a variety of games on this channel for everybody. And yeah, another thing is comment down below anything that I'm doing wrong, anything that I could do that I could be doing to make the channel better, the community better, myself better, just anything like that, just comment it down below. It will be much appreciated, and I'll see you guys in another video, so definitely have a fantastic day, and stay awesome as always.